Wanting to try and deny this, and Peanut has actually no idea as he kites his way in. There's the watch out Eep that he has to definitely watch out for. Gets the water. Adam doesn't down. have smite. Yeah, no smite available, but watch out Eep doesn't. This is this is not very fair at all. As uh, you can see, Rich actually being pretty aggressive onto Z Zeus. I'm going to probably say <laughs> Zeus a couple of times. That's okay. I don't know whether Kellen has been spotted on exactly this brush as a carrier. Thinking about coming through. Should be the Rift Scuttler locked down for Peanut as Carrier face checks. Hook is going to miss onto Elam though as Kellen's in a lot of trouble. Faker doesn't have the Emperor's Divide, but they're not going to need it. That's going to be Zayas picking up First Blood. Welcome to the LCK, my friend. Able to grab First Blood. Faker picks up the next one. It's going to be the Drake uh, just delivered over uh, to Nomchim. And uh, we're going to see it, like that decision not made. Good playback there, but Kellen's still dead. Elam comes in, steals that one away. And uh, Dr. Um, He's this is definitely a series for Faker to have his 600th game opportunity. Is uh, Zayas possibly in trouble here as Peanut's trying to lock him down. The Naba coming on through. Really good game sense from Zayas to make sure that he can get towards Faker, who flashes. Oh in no! Zayas is still alive and they're asleep. It's a double kill for the Lilia. The rest of his team. This is as bad as he gets, honestly, though. And look here, there's no vision. There's no support. Oh, so uh, sick. Yeah. Okay, so you know what we were saying earlier uh, about T1, you know, keeping it together so far? Um, 100%. You know, I, I really appreciate that they show this kind of level of gameplay in my good new game. I think it was really nice of them. <laughs> yeah, it was I really all for appreciate you. It was that. All for yeah. You. Um, yeah. Absolutely. I think um, someone obviously yeah. absolutely no interest in. The Spake is roaming down as well. That's going to be the stun from Carrier. Peanut. Taking a bit of damage from that Void Seeker, the hook's gonna go wide. And this is... Pushing the envelope constantly as Carrier goes in. Whoa, the big on, big old flash forward as there's the Gravity Storm. Does do decently, but the stun down, and that is a very, very dead bay. Um, you're still fine. Uh, okay. Yeah, you know, just fine. taking a lot of free damage. It's gonna be okay, has a Lantern. As another Solar Flare lands, Doc Darm has to Feather Storm, Flash, Cleanse, every- Just play for uh, Mountain Soul and keep it at that. Oh, Carrier, he doesn't want that at all as he gets flayed back. Eclipse is going to go off as the teleport does come through. Bay in the back line quite nicely, but Rich immediately has to get out and Faker does a lot of damage. A Conquering Sands is terrifying as, oh, that was not the time to Blade Caller. Dokdan does manage to flash out, but in goes Gumiyushi, and Elam's going to take a nap underneath this turret. Does go golden, that should try and keep him alive, but he's still going to be dead. And that is another engage. The re-engage towards the top side. Bay is going to go down immediately. Peanut now running for the hills. The crocodile going to be in trouble. And the sleep finally does come down. I actually thought Ellen used that before, but... Like, not the feeling that you get in every single lane, right? Like, oh, it's not bad. Isaias, uh, Isaias? Yeah, he uh, might be in a little bit of trouble here as he does get Megana. There is the Gnar back. It's going to get rid of three of them for now. We'll see whether he can move fast enough. They're going to bring an extra person as Asterix does go off. In he goes once again. That's the double wall. The sleep comes down. Zayus is unkillable in this game. What the hell was that? Almost the triple kill there as the Empress Divide gets rid of Rich. He flashes on back in. He wants to try and take down Faker, but he just doesn't have enough damage. It's a double kill for the Azir in the end, and this may just be the game.
Can you get a more perfect introduction to the LCK? What a debut coming out here from Zayus, because that looked like everyone would have forgotten, uh, forgiven him if he died there, right? Like, it's happened. It, oh, it happens. yeah, of course. It's your first game. It's fine. But instead, he turns it around, and T1 is looking a lot better today, Atlas. I think so too. I think they're onto something with this particular roster as in goes Faker, looking for a bit of damage there onto Kellen. He's free food. Peanut's going to be the same thing. Sort of like the bag of peanuts that you get when you're on the aeroplane. I'm